welcome you all back to my channel my name is Aisha in today's video I will be showing you the easiest way to cut out your friends so you can see I have it here already with me so this is it thank you all for your support God bless you all if you are new to my channel kindly click on the subscribe button don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that whenever I upload a new video you will be notified I have my pattern paper here with me for you to fold your flowings assuming this is your material that you are using also this is the material you fold it this way and you fold it this way like this if this is material that you are using you can use your iron to press it for you to get this shape so that it will give you that shape so that you will know the center point of your frames so because this is pattern paper so it's very easier for me to get you can just use your hand to press it this way so let me open it you open it this way so you can see you can see I have my center point here. So from here, I'll come here. This is my center point. This is my center point. So now the radius I will be using. I will be using one inch for the radius. So now I will measure one inch all around from this center point here. You measure one inch all around. I will be using one inch for my radius. So you measure one inch all round from this point. see this is our radius now I use one inch for the radius all around this is it us to cut out our frames I will be making use of three inches for the length so the length of the frames how wide you want it you can decide to make use of two inches you can decide to make use of four five so it depends on what you are using it for so but as for me I will be making use of three inches So you come here, you can just rule it out. I have it in four quadrants now. One, two, three, four. So I will now come to the center point here. You can pick any of the quadrants that you want so i'll come here let's assume i'll be using this one as my first quadrant so i'll come here i'll measure half inch from this point from this point a you measure half inch backward so i'll measure half inch backward so this is my half inch you can see this is my half inch and i'll come to the second quadrant here this second quadrant here so from here i'll assume this is my center point so i'll assume this is my center point of the second quadrant so from here the inches that i'm using for the length of our frames i'm making use of three inches for the length of the frames so i'll come here i'll measure three inches so i'll measure three inches backward we continue So now, from here, you connect it from here, from this point here, not this one, 
from this first quadrant you know we go backward by half inch here so you connect it to meet with this so i'll connect it to meet with this you can make use of your free hand and you can also make use of your so but i'll be making use of my french curl so this is it so from there so you'll be taking your three inches round so you take your three inches all round From here so you measure your three inches from here not from here from this line this line that meets here so you measure your three inches from there There is no more space, so this is where I'm going to stop my friends. You can see three inches. This is where my three inches we stop. So this is the hand of my friends. So let me trace it back. You can see just come here 
you know we start from this point we divide where our three inches starts from you can see so this is where our three inches starts from so you come here you can just give it a straight line that's a guide for you to know where your flowing starts from you can see this is it so you can see it so this is it so this is where our friends will start from so this side is going out yeah you can see here yeah, like this is going out so you can see it so this is our friends so now i will be cutting it out i'll be starting my cutting from here so. So this is where our three inches stop, so you can see. So if you should come, if you should come here, it's not up to three. So this is where our three inches stop. So you just give it a line. So you draw a line there. So you just. So this is where our three inches stop. So you can see it. So now from there, I can easily cut it. I can easily cut it out you can see so we have it this way so now I will go ahead it so i've cut it out you can see it so cut this out so this is our friends you can see so, you can use it This is it you can use it to form any design on your dress on your blouse on your skirt so on, on your sleeve you can use it to form any design so you can see how simple it is if you find this video helpful kindly give it a thumbs up if you have any question or suggestion you can drop it in the comment section below kindly subscribe to my channel and make sure it turns on your notification bell so that whenever i upload a new video you'll be notified thanks for watching bye